Hi Aquarius and welcome to your weekly love tarot forecast. This is for the week of September 17th through September 23rd, 2018. So Aquarius, let's see what is on the menu for you guys this week. What is up for you guys? Love and romance. Pisces, I believe. Oh, goodness me. Grand Trine, blessings. Okay, we're two for two. And, oh my gosh, so good. We are three for three. Part of fortune increase. And I love this is 45, 46. Oh, that 9, 10, right? Um, Aquarius, this is great. Um, some of you, if you're dealing with the Pisces, you guys might uh, just be madly blessed this week, fall in love. If you meet a Pisces this week, um, it looks awesome. Those of you who are single, single, like haven't had anything on the horizon, uh, this week could be very blessed. Get yourself out there. Do not stay cooped up in the house, okay? Um, take some walks. Go to your bookstore. You know, join an extracurricular activity. Go take a painting class. You know, whatever it is you got to do, um, go do it. Get out and about this week with this energy. Oh my gosh. If anybody's trying to set you up on a date with somebody they know, do it. Um, any person that you meet this week it looks very strong connection um somebody you have been kind of dating or seeing for you know uh, maybe a couple weeks it, this we might decide to get committed this week um if we've been committed we might decide let's move in together this week you know this is just nice um those who are committed, you know, there could be blessings coming to your relationship this week. However, that, you know, works out for you personally, getting a raise, somebody getting a new job, you guys getting the house that you really want to buy. You know, it's different for all of you. But whether you are single, dating or coupled, Aquarius, my God, you are blessed this week in love. Holy cow. Like it just it don't get much better than that. And with this here, it's a very spiritual connection as well okay so let's get into the emotions here I love it this is great I mean grand trying blessings come on like that's perfect uh, energy flow right there and part of fortune increase you know that's where if you were feeling somebody you guys are taking it to the whole next level all right, it's just great, Aquarius. Really good. Okay. And then we have codependency, but you know what? This card can mean that honeymoon phase where we are just incredibly wrapped up in each other. All right, let go of control issues. Um, somebody might be feeling a little bit nervous over there huh, and look at the very next card honeymoon yeah um i really feel like you know whoever you're involved with this week aquarius you guys are really feeling emotions for each other really feeling a strong connection it's a little bit scary okay um if you're in a commitment i feel you know it's kind of the same thing like I just if you are an Aquarius that is not happy in your relationship like specifically I don't know that this is the reading for you and if it is it's saying hey just kind of let go of control start focusing on what is positive and you know you guys might have this miraculous turnaround of energy it's just this is very positive a hundred percent if anything it looks like we're a little afraid of the intensity of the emotions of the connection of just how destined this feels for some of you okay and this person might want to control you a little bit not because they're a controlling, jealous, narcissistic person, but because, again, it's like the intensity 
that you guys share is, is a bit overwhelming and you know they don't want to lose you so let's see here Aquarius over here we have spiritual quest and over here we have sunshine shine forth yeah um, Aquarius I feel like with this either this is them saying you are my sunshine or you're saying to them you are my sunshine and with spiritual quest again this is where it's very intense the emotions the connection and so it's kind of challenging but it's not challenging in a bad negative way whatsoever no this is where things are going good things are going positive and you're like is the other shoe gonna drop <laughs> you know that type of energy and sometimes you know we sabotage ourselves when things are going really good because we're like nope this is too good this doesn't happen for me well guess what Aquarius this week yes it is and uh, that spiritual quest um, I just feel it's like this the um, spiritual connection between you and another person that um, is kind of overwhelming you or maybe even bringing you guys back together this week if you've been estranged from each other okay um, those who are committed you know uh, if you are feeling anything inside, you know, that like you're feeling stressed or I just feel like they're a great support system for you or you're, uh, yeah, I just, I can't see negative here. I'm sorry, guys. Like, this is really good stuff. So let's see what the uh, Aquarius, I don't like this. Why? Why are we coming out in this position? This is, I'm keeping things to myself. This is where I'm sharing, but this is where, no, I'm keeping things to myself. Hmm, let's see. Okay, but good, 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 good. We have the uh, Wheel of Fortune in this position, and most excellent over on this side, we have the Hanged Man in this position. And um, here we have the Eight of Wands and Aquarius, look what would be out next. Ace of Cups. So listen, guys. Um, you know what I'm seeing here? Um, somebody you haven't spoken to in a while might actually reach out to you and be like, Aquarius, you're just, you're all I want. Like, I seriously want you. Please be mine. Or Aquarius, just because we have spiritual quest and hermit here, this could be where the ball has been in your court, okay? And, um, you know, you've been trying to decide, do I want to give this person a chance? Do I want to be with them? And it's like you're deciding, yes, I want to be with you. I want to give this an opportunity. And I just want to say, Aquarius, with Will of Fortune on, in this position plus this uh, part of Fortune, oh, my God, this is such a blessed... Um, romance okay this is a blessed union new opportunities coming to you guys this week very blessed very fortunate um, you guys just click you connect spiritual is what I'm getting more than anything um, for singles coupled or just dating um, whoever you are involved with it's like you guys have this an amazing spiritual connection just un there's no words for it Aquarius there's really really not and uh, I realized I was about to pull you guys some um, sexual magic tarot but I realized I didn't do that for the, uh, the other signs for some reason so if I start doing that in yours people are gonna be like oh why didn't you do that in mine so I'll just leave those out for this week but Aquarius but it's kind of killing me. I'm like, I want to see what they say, but I can't. It's not fair to everybody if I didn't do it for everybody. Um, Aquarius, listen, this is a blessed week in love and romance. I, it doesn't matter which way you look at it. Anybody trying to give you their cup this week, they are all about you. Like, they mean it. They want you. Um, you know, I feel like anybody you're kind of offering your cup to this week is open to it. Um, the couples, you guys are getting along. You're seeing things from new perspectives. There's new blessings coming in for you guys. Unexpected blessings. Um, man, just so good. And reconnections. I do see that. All right, let's get an outcome here.
Yes. Oh, yes. We got the moon tree. And the very next card, Aquarius, would actually be miracles, okay? The moon tree is for sure about something, um, a reconnection um, from somebody. So this could be Aquarius where maybe you and a friend, an old fling, an old flame, a misconnection, you know, whatever. You guys, it's like the universe is bringing y'all back together this week, okay? Um, and maybe up to the Aquarius. Aries full moon. I believe the Aries full moon is on the 24th of September. So like the Monday after this reading, well, it's the Monday following the time frame of this reading. So um, maybe you guys could say up to the 24th of September, you might have a reconnection from somebody you haven't heard from in quite some time, like blast from the past big time. But it would be legit like the universe is bringing you guys together okay um those of you couples who have been in the struggle like i said it's over this week there is some magic some miracle that comes into your relationship that helps you guys out whether it's the connection between the two of you or there's just other factors that you guys have been dealing with you know normal life stresses and challenges and it's like here is this blessing of energy those of you who are single it's like, man, I get out there. Like I said, you just don't even know. Um, all of you Aquariuses may hear from some people quite unexpectedly, or you might unexpectedly decide to reach out to some people because, again, there's this deep spiritual connection, and um, I feel like destiny and fate are at hand, and the universe is divinely intervening to bring you and another person together. So off the charts reading for Aquarius. I have nothing ugly to say. It's all beautiful. Um, at least the Aquarius's spirit is giving me messages for its beautiful week. You guys are so blessed and loved. Just go with it. Trust it. No other shoe's about to drop. This is all for you, Aquarius. So those are your messages in regards to love and romance. I am wishing you all the very best. Take care.